Uh, well, of course, I've felt delighted and honoured. Mainly, I just think it's, you know, it's extremely imaginative for a new, newish prize in cognitive science to have been, to, to have been um, established by the Heineken Foundation because I think it's, it does reflect a subject that uh, has found its feet, really, in the last 20 or 30 years. And I think this, this, puts, uh, this, uh, this reflects that. And looking back on 50 years from now, I'm sure the Foundation will think, that was a really good idea because this subject was really getting going. I mean, when I um, studied as an undergraduate, I, com I did a combined degree in psychology and physiology. And at that time, it would have been completely inconceivable that you could be thinking about complex cognitive functions such as language, memory, attention, uh, intelligence, in terms of the actual behaviour of billions of neurons in the brain and over the work of the last three or four decades has, has transformed that. It's slow, but it's transformed so that now this not only seems like a dream, it seems like something that's, that's really happening. And therefore, I think this new field has become established in a way that um, you know, would have been unimaginable a short, few, short period of time ago. There was a very amusing conversation by the pre from the president of KNAAW who, started, who called me up and said, I'm hoping this will be a pleasant conversation. And at the end, I thought, you didn't have to hope that much, did he? <laughs>